And that's where we begin. Thousands of people around Tampa Bay have gone high tech when it comes to their doorbell and surveillance cameras around their homes. But now Ring and gadgets like it have been getting some criticism that could have people weighing whether or not that sense of security is worth it. 10 News reporter Eric Glasser shows you why. It's so worth it just to have the peace of mind. Kristen Barron, like hundreds of others in the Bay Area, gives her video doorbell system rave reviews, capturing video she shared with cops of a porch pirate who'd swiped her package. I'm just thankful that we have it and that it's a way for us to show them exactly what happened. It's very valuable to, uh, to our detectives. Tampa PD, Clearwater Police, Bradenton and Manatee County are just some of the agencies that have joined the Ring App Network, encouraging people to upload and share images of people in their neighborhoods. I can't tell you how many crimes we solve uh, based on video. But lately, the ring itself has been coming under fire. A lawyer for the American Civil Liberties Union calling it an unmitigated disaster when it comes to people's privacy. Other critics saying that it creates a disproportionate suspicion of minorities. Critics also accuse Ring, which is a subsidiary of Amazon, of leveraging its relationship with police departments to increase sales, subsidizing the cost of cameras in some areas, and using dramatic videos to create a sense of urgency, even where crime stats are down. Amazon is profiting off of fear, said Chris Gilliard, a professor at Michigan's Macomb Community College, selling the cameras in neighborhoods where the fear of crime is more real than the actual existence of crime. I don't like all the interconnectivity right now because they haven't protected the consumers, in my opinion. I feel like if you put yourself in that space, you've made yourself available for potentially being recorded. Ring itself has suggested it's part of the reason crime has declined in some neighborhoods. As more people know about this technology, would-be burglars or criminals will actually leave the property before even trying something if they know that they're on camera or they think that someone might be home. Which may be why, despite those privacy concerns and marketing criticisms, Ring and similar products continue to be among the hottest consumer items out there. We encourage people to, to get surveillance cameras. I, I think that it, uh, that it not only helps us solve crimes, but if you're a smart criminal, you probably don't want to be caught on videos. Police tell us in some cases those home surveillance systems can speed up the response time if they can visually confirm that a crime is in process. But in the vast majority of cases, they say they're working with videos submitted to them well after the crime has occurred.